Hey, what's up? Rizzo here for nextgenwalkthroughs.com, and this is Fallout 3 uh, Galaxy News Radio. So we finally made it to the Museum of Technology looking for the, uh, the satellite dish to repair the signal. Uh, the trek here was rather long, um, and I showed you how to get there from GNR if you've been following this uh, walkthrough completely. But there's a shorter way to get here um, if you travel to... Uh, to Rivet City, there's a train station subway system that you can follow through, uh, and you can get here a little bit faster. So the um, the trek through this building isn't too long or difficult. Uh, there's a number of super mutants to take out, and I believe the first super mutant brute to take care of. Um, if you've been following this walkthrough exactly, uh, this room up here has a couple uh, computers in it computer terminals that can be hacked. Um, there's a system of turrets here that are deactivated and if your science is high enough you can hack that one terminal and uh, activate the turrets for some help but uh, mine isn't so we're gonna, I'm gonna be doing this the old-fashioned way. So come up here, and you're going to be taking the uh, the vault tour, which is uh, pretty interesting. Uh, it's a neat little thing that they put into the game. Uh, I was surprised to run into it the first time. Um, there's no there's no um, combat in this area. Uh, feel free to look at the displays if you want, but I'm just going to be running straight through it. Not only did the developers put this in the game, but they uh, they blocked off certain paths throughout this museum, so they pretty much forced you to have to uh, see this vault recreation that they put in, which is a, a really great idea and executed very well. So, anyway, continuing on. Uh, there's a system of turret not turrets, um, computer terminals here that, uh, have, um, these, uh, it's like a, a little game that this guy named Prime left for his, uh, his homie, and he has this, um, it, it gives you a key and a location of this armor, um, of this weapons cache that he's run into and it leads to a unique uh, Chinese assault rifle uh, so if you're interested in doing that just check all the terminals there's uh, three of them uh, if you see um, three numbers a zero 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 one zero zero two zero zero three just uh, choose the um, the prime number that's in there and uh, you'll be given all that information um, I believe I'll be covering how to do that in a separate video uh, I just cut it out of here because it's not essential and it's just going to make this uh, really long mission take a lot longer than it really has to. Uh, as you can see coming into this area there's uh, a couple super mutants. Um, I'm using a sniper rifle uh, which was a good idea against the guys that are far away but a terrible idea against this guy who came right in my face. Uh, use an assault rifle or a uh, hunting rifle, there's that guy that was who's to the left right there, he came from the top floor and there's two super mutants on the bottom floor. Uh, again, once you start taking them out it shouldn't be too much of a problem to deal with. I, I tried to get this guy to uh, step on the frag mine but he never did. I like using the frag mines. If you throw a mine out, um, you want to disarm it before you pick it back up because if you step on it, it'll blow up on you. Uh, frag mines, no, no friends. Uh, 
Oh, by the way, it's probably the second or third time this mission. Uh, if you ever see a uh, message that I'm over encumbered, uh, and then I'm not, it's just because I'm editing out all the repairing and weapon dropping. So here's a locked door that I can't pick. Um, if you go through there, I believe it's a shortcut. Uh, it'll get you through this mission faster. But the dish that we're looking for is on the bottom, is on the ground floor. All right, so just keep going along. Um, we're gonna go down. Uh, we're almost there, I promise. All right, so it's just up ahead. You're gonna walk over to the uh, the shuttle replica that they have there, and the dish is gonna be attached to it. And there's one super mutant up to the right. Uh, he starts shooting at me. I probably should have taken him out before I picked up the dish. Uh take him out and th but there's also a super mutant brute coming from the other hallway I totally forgot he was coming um use whatever explosive weapons you have um frag grenades frag mines I have a, a rocket launcher uh, that I'm gonna be using on him in a second uh, I'm incredibly low level to be dealing with a, a super mutant like this so I have to make a run for it Uh, this is actually a pretty uh, tough encounter uh, if you're very early on in the game. That's why I had to break out the big guns. Matter of fact, I wanted to use the uh, the fat man on him. But I decided that would probably be a bad idea. It's about damn time. Okay, so anyway, um, there's a stealth boy um, allegedly behind the uh, the lander that you took the satellite dish off of, but I'm not too sure if it's there. Just go check, because uh, we're going to need a stealth boy in for the uh, the next video. So anyway, just um, follow along. Uh, this is where the... Um, the key for the loot would be if you were doing the uh, the side mission with the uh, with the terminals. It would be in here, and that's safe. So anyway, just uh, follow along, and I'll see you back at the mall.